Time again for a Mayor's Minutes update. Mayor Bill Blonigan from Robbinsdale joining us. Welcome, Mayor. Thank you, Dave. Let's begin with an update on the city manager search. How is that progressing? So the person, Tim Sandvik, has been chosen to be our next city manager by the city council. He's got broad experience. He has a master's in public administration and nonprofit administration. He's worked for New Brighton, Falcon Heights, He's worked for Brooklyn Park. He's currently the assistant city administrator mm -hmm. for the city of Vadnais Heights. And we're excited to welcome him on board. He's got experience in almost every department in city government. And while it might be hard to replace our record longest city manager, Marsha Glick, mm -hmm. we're excited, both staff and the city council, that we've got a high potential person coming in to take over the reins as city manager. Exciting news for the city. Let's talk about the Emerald Ash Bore. It's treatment time. What can residents expect? So this devastating foreign pest, we've got it under control with public trees because we treat our public ash trees once every three years. But the city forester has told us that this is probably the year that they, it will really explode in Robbinsdale on private land. Mm -hmm. And it might be the last time you can figure out that this is the time to treat your ash trees so people could save money by not having to cut down their ash tree and they could also have a better looking yard if they consider checking out private treatment. All right. Water talk in the city of Robbinsdale, something we've talked about for a while. What is the update on treatment plant and water tower? So treatment plant, the all-time biggest infrastructure project we've ever had. We're now on the inside of the building and that's proceeding nicely. Water tower, we just voted to uh, accept the bid for a 750,000 ga gallon water tower, replacing our 150 which is downtown, mm -hmm. and the bids were over budget. The budget was $4,720,000, the low bid was $5,977,000, so we'll have to do some value engineering, techno speak for cutting some costs, and try to get that thing under budget or right to where it needs to be. All right, final couple seconds here. Mention a new farmer's market coming to the area and also Step To It Challenge. That challenge is in the month of May. Step to it.org to find out more and quickly the market coming to Lakeview Terrace. City has to be excited. May through September, Lakeview Terrace, 8 a.m. till 1 p.m. The person that's running it, she has great experience, so go down to Lakeview Terrace and try it out. All right, City's website, the place for all that information. Mayor, thanks for your time. We'll talk to you again soon. Thank you so much, Dave. Learn more about The Connection at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.